Hello Scorpios, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. I'm gonna be doing a general reading. Let's see what's gonna happen between 15 April to 15 May. Let's see, as this is going to be a general message, take what resonates and leave what does not resonate. For personal readings, white spells and premium charge crystals, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. Ooh, let's see. All the details are given down below in the description box. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign, Mercury sign, and Scorpio, Plus Cross Watchers. I see the messages for you. Oh, I feel like this is your situation in the recent past where you were going here and there uh, aimlessly or you were being thrown in different directions but you were not getting any kind of success, especially financial success, work-related success. You felt like nobody was understanding what you were trying to receive or what you want. You're still doing your best, but you don't know which way to go, what to do in order to get that success or in order to get that outcome I'm looking for. Nobody was ready to listen to you. You were feeling helpless like a little kid, innocent kid, not knowing what to do. But there's a shift, there's a shift, there's a change. With the three of pentacles, someone is here or you found your purpose. You know what you want now. And you also have been coming across those people that are helping you build a team at work and gain success. That means the efforts that you're putting are being reciprocated from the other person as well. And you're getting a lot of help and support when it comes to your financial growth. Working in a team is a much better thing to do rather than working alone. This is important, Scorpio. So you've earned that think okay even at your workplace if there was a lot of politics and you felt excluded and you felt like you were not getting credit of it fortunately the wheel is turning in such a manner in your favor you are receiving credit you're receiving success you're receiving the hike or a promotion you were waiting for you're receiving the group of clients you wanted more clients you wanted more business growth whatever it is with the seek with the with the help okay of people around you're getting justice and life is going to change someone is putting equal efforts you are putting equal efforts and working in cooperation is happening now earlier it was all about you trying to convince and it's not just not working your boss is not listening your juniors are not listening or if you're a business person and you didn't have anyone to help you there's a shift happening. And with this shift, I'm seeing there's financial growth and abundance coming in. Some of you are going to reach the highest position or the highest point when it comes to your career, when it comes to your business. Your expectations will be surpassed with the amount of growth you're going to receive. Right down the comment section, I'm making a lot of money. I'm working hard. I believe in others, I'm cooperative, and I'm in abundance, okay? I'm living in abundance, that's it. That's all you have to write, I'm living in abundance, that's it. Let universe do the rest for you. So the Ten of Pentacles energy is like a lot of growth, lot of money, income, happiness, success, newer ventures at work, new projects, okay, new foundations, are going to be laid. Someone at a long distance is thinking about you. Okay, this person could be younger. And maybe this is someone that you're linked with regarding work. But I'm definitely seeing that this person is thinking highly about you. In good terms. They want to bring happiness. They want to bring positivity. Especially if this is your junior. But it's something to do with the work. Okay. Receive. Oh, receive in the occupation. Oh my gosh, you have to be careful. Your work, whatever you're doing, 
can your credit can be taken away maybe when the time comes you receive success you're happy there is a birth of jealousy okay i feel it can happen that at one point of time the person shifts the person is changeable whoever you're relying on scorpio right now this person can change any time okay it is like they want to take away the credit they want to take away what belongs to you that's the energy that i'm seeing there's a possibility of someone that is trying to get your personal details to attack you and that might happen not now later on so here there is a need for you to be careful with whom you are working okay there is politics even though right now things are really good and you will reach the highest point your expectations uh i feel are going to be surpassed by the reality i'm seeing a lot of success coming into you but with success will come jealousy so the ones that have been your a uh, cooperative partners your helping hand might start taking away your credit or start getting jealous of you okay that's what i'm seeing is there any more messages oh my scorpio this person is someone that is at your office or this is someone that is a job person okay are you taking help of this person main female okay let me see change okay this is talking about oh there's a possibility especially if you guys are opposite sex if you're a male then it's a female for you if you're a female then it's a male for you at work that will change after some time and this person isn't reliable initially they are reliable they will help you they will be with you okay scorpio but later on i'm seeing them changing be very careful whoever this is maybe their birthday adds up to 9 or 8 or 4 or 2 they're just trying to bind you emotionally so that you become dependent on them yeah oh my gosh you have to be really careful this person is evil maybe there's a agenda behind it i scorpio this might not resonate with each one of you i'm also going to get to your love message but it's time for you to make proper decisions because sitting and thinking and making clear decisions and judgments will really help you in your way some of you this could be a capricorn you have to be very very concerned you know aware of i'm seeing they're burning in jealousy there's someone that is burning in jealousy with your success and this person was once your friend so pay attention okay right now this is someone that is like a friend to you but later on can turn into your enemy that's very strongly possible okay seven of cups how will things end up like will you find a solution for yourself we see okay you may need to be patient observe don't react just keep observing and you may need to find an alternate job alternate a uh, team alternate project to get rid of this person later on you should have a backup think of a backup this is something that i'm seeing here i don't know why i'm getting such messages but someone may need to know about this but i feel like it has to do with the workplace politics work related politics yeah i'm seeing 7 and 7 over here you're confused about this person deep inside you know intuitively that something is wrong at work so right now you can't do anything about it all you have to do is just keep observing relax take some time and you will immediately come out of a the situation with a good decision it's not going to be that bad give a relationship a chance express your love you have your soulmate coming towards you now let's see when your soulmate is coming towards you how okay okay nine of wands page of pentacles they are slow moving but when this person comes to see you when you are 
when you catch this person's attention oh my gosh they're not going to stop themselves they will be extremely passionate to approach you to propose you to date you to ask you out to take things forward immediately this person will be extremely expressive they will be proposing you and i'm dead sure that you have a soulmate coming towards you for sure and this person is full of passion zeal attraction and love both the things are there they don't like to speak much okay they are someone that appears to be a mystery because they keep a lot of things to themselves okay uh, i'm also seeing yes they are expressive in love but yes they don't like to speak much this is more of a shyer coiter personality they like to show their feelings through actions as well like in short they're not a chatter okay they're, they're more like logical practical smart i feel this person is very strong and powerful whoever this is academician some of you this person is very intelligent they have a lot of knowledge about their field this person is a winner in life but they don't talk, talk about random things they don't like chit chat too much okay they're quiet person they don't like to talk much this person is extremely sorted in life unlike you <laughs> okay let's see what else right now i'm ready to meet my soulmate i'm ready to see the change in my life oh my gosh the moment i said change i got the change card oh my gosh that's how the universe and divine angels are supporting us scorpio high five okay like this video to increase the energy of this really boost it okay the change you have no idea scorpio you don't see it but you're actually evolving you're changing your energies are changing everything is changing because you're learning you're growing you're improvising you're making changes you're learning about people you're uh, knowing what are the mistakes you don't have to make again but be careful of the attachment but because the moment you get attached you lose your confidence and power to someone else this is the only weakness scorpio that you have to pay focus on because as long as you're not attached to someone you have the power but the moment you get attached to someone oh my gosh this person or whoever this is at work is going to take it take advantage of you this is what i'm seeing like initially they're going to be all nice and sweet with you you know to win you the moment you get attached they'll start ruling over you okay and you might not even realize okay you're credit has been taken your position has been taken you're being re replaced so these are the things you have to be really careful about scorpio this is important okay you don't take it lightly i have to tell you this because this is what universe is asking me to tell you angels are asking me to tell you i'm not doing anything okay myself imagine let's see what this is i'm seeing a lot of twos which means you're feeling extremely emotional you need to vent out by doing some things like self love activities exercising stretching or doing certain things you always wanted to do but you didn't get time do those things i feel that will help you to leave the um emotional stress that you're taking to yourself because you're highly intuitive and you're extremely empathic you tend to absorb other people's energies and you feel for others unlike you know other signs i don't know i think that you have stronger uh emotional drainage scorpios get drained more easily than any other sign so you have to give a lot of time to yourself for your emotional balance okay i'm also seeing you have a tendency to you know be a control freak you're trying to control how things should flow you're not going easy you're not going with the flow you're imagining okay this is what should be done then this is what should be done and when something goes against your planning it hurts you it makes you emotional you have to understand that everybody is different and they will do what they want to do all you have to do is just let it be whatever has hap has to happen will happen i should not imagine about the future i should only imagine about how i want to see myself down the line okay because that is the reason why things are just not able to move forward and you go back and forth because sometimes you're like you take three steps forward you go back two steps it's because you start imagining the uh you know the journey like for example you've told someone that this is the work uh we will be doing and then 
later on you start imagining okay this person will do this and this you're you're trying to you know control the situation not letting it be free and that is the reason and if someone hurts you after giving you a lot of trust if someone hurts you you're not able to get out of that feeling and that give, kicks you back okay that makes you go back and forth and so when you don't get emotionally attached okay and then suddenly someone changes it doesn't affect you and you still move forward this is an important message for you scorpio okay tie it down to yourself forever so that you don't get yourself hurt in future some some seeing something to do with you getting hurt because of disappointments you are only the only reason because you're a strong personality the only thing that hurts you is disappointed disappointments when someone disappoints you reconsider success you may need to reevaluate the work reevaluate the person you're working with reevaluate how things should go and you will definitely have success you may need to plan down and stick to that plan and don't keep changing because someone else is telling you and you're emotionally attached to that person i'm definitely seeing you're going to make a lot of changes with new love coming into your life and you will definitely lead towards success as i was telling in the past readings your new lover is playing an important role in helping you achieve your goals and this is under person there okay and then you're having a message for you oh my gosh this person is someone that will fill you with happiness 101 person this is someone that is going to fill you with happiness okay they will tell you they love you they'll do everything for you and that's going to make you smile every time you feel low i feel this person is going to bring that change in you by sending you positive affirmations and the proposals the expression that they have for you towards you is going to heal your heart and liberate your soul i'm hearing liberating 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 in every reading for you pucker up you have no idea how happy and lucky you're going to be scorpio touch word write down the comment section i'm happy i'm lucky and i'm i care for myself so this is one thing very important do what you want to do do what you love okay don't do it for others do it for yourself this is one thing that is very very important and i'm also seeing this person will want you to do things for yourself they will not ask for it they won't expect Okay. Any other messages to my beautiful Scorpio? My Scorpio clan books. Read books, okay, because that is your best getaway. And even for me, books are like the best getaway. Whatever time I get, I at least tend to read a bit. So it is extremely calming to senses, and it also helps you learn something new. So learning, higher learning, improvising on your skills, reading, writing. all of these things will help you liberate more and that, yes you need to release the tendencies that you have of absorbing other people's energies by getting attached to other people emotionally trusting other people way too much and or there is someone from the past that you need to release let me see the signs coming towards you we have a pisces we have taurus we have cancer and we have cancer again okay oh why me okay I want to pull one more message for my beautiful Scorpio group. Isn't this exciting? Oh my gosh! Endless. Eight is a number of success and goals, and I'm definitely seeing you again. Whatever you're working on, guys, get serious because you're going to make a lot of impact with your success, influence on people, with your money as well. So you will have money, power, name, fame, success, everything you ask for. But you have to work for it. Okay, you have to make those changes. Not me. That's gonna like bring about that miracle in your life. And then we're seeing Scorpio. Trust your path. Whatever you are doing is your life purpose. Trust it. You're being heavily supported to follow it, and you're going through inner awakening, which will help you uh, expand in your field, grow in your field. and you will start to work things with a new perspective now let me see from aries to pisces what is your person think if you feel in love whoever you're dealing with right now aries towards scorpio aries is trying hard to communicate with you but you don't want to deal with this person stuff taurus they see you as a dream come true as a person that they would want to marry gemini they're trying hard to convince you because you're the only person that they see a future with they want you so bad cancer 
cancer wants you, but there's something that they need to let go of before they can come towards you. That is why they're taking time. Leo. They're scared of rejection because this person has a huge crush on you, but they are highly egoistic. Virgo. Okay. The Virgo wants to be left alone, but they have been thinking about you a lot. They like you, but they might not tell you. If they want to tell you, they will tell you after some time. Libra. The Libra feels like you're a new, a breath of fresh air, and they're feeling so excited to get to know you, date you, and they just cannot uh, relax. They just, just want all of you. Scorpio towards Scorpio, please. Okay. They want equal give and take. They want your attention. They want your love. They want your time. And if there is something that has happened, they really want to reconcile and heal things. They feel strong pull towards you. Sagittarius. Okay. The Sagittarius is, I feel they have intense passion for you. They just cannot wait to meet you, see you, hug you, and have a new beginning with you. Capricorn. Okay. Capricorn. They're shy. They're hesitant. They're taking time. Um, I feel like they have been hurt in the past, so they're going to take cautious steps towards you, but they are consistent. They like you. Aquarius. Aquarius is thinking a lot about you. Instead of taking action, I feel they're too laid back and procrastinating. Let's see Pisces. Pisces is more about me, myself and I, me and my business. You mind your own business. I mind my own business, but I like to see you, but I don't want you. You know, you're getting it. A Pisces is more about money, money, money their career their job but they like to see you okay but they're not thinking about any any serious relationship or stuff like that all right and then we are having law someone is in law here or you can have some law involvement coming in in the near future i'm seeing definitely your lover could be into law they could be a lawyer but I'm definitely seeing love is coming into your life. Spread love to earn love. So I'm seeing like angels are blessing you. You're protected. If something negative happens, you are going to be protected. Okay. So you don't have to be worried about the scene. Okay. Uh, I'm also seeing marriage here. B-W-I-T-L-N-R. The names uh, are the letters in the name of you or your person. But this is a fated connection that's going to happen. You're going to fall in love, both of you. And I feel this is going to get legalized. That means that you guys are going to make it official. Someone's name is Nathan. Someone's from Botswana, Bangkok, Bangladesh, Taiwan. Okay. Tasmania. Um, Boston, West Indies. Uh, someone speaks Tamil. Could be from India, America, New York, Norway, New Zealand. Thailand, Dubai, UAE, Beijing, okay, Washington, mm, Texas, Las Vegas, Los Angeles. Someone is a celebrity watching this read for sure today. Okay, I'm seeing Nil. So something in your life feels lacking right now, but this is going to be reversed real soon, okay? Someone is into like uh, arts and entertainment. I'm also seeing witty. Wit, your wit and humor is extremely lethal and attracts people towards you. Someone's from London, British. Someone's from LGBT. Someone is a Lebanese, Lebanon. I'm also seeing nighttime. You, you're more energetic and want to go out and travel, have fun at, in the evening time. Yeah, someone has a science, into science field, is also what I'm seeing. <sighs> Lena could be the name. Anthony. Someone from Nigeria. Okay. Canada, Ibiza, Venezuela. So these are certain messages that I got. The rest of the messages you can make out yourself. And I wish you all the best, Scorpio. As usual, stay tuned, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Do I and I'll see you back again with more stuff.